everyone and welcome all of you back to my channel first to explain that if you can see my hair kind of like blowing like Cindy Crawford advert in the 90s is because I have a fan here in, in between my legs almost because it's so bloody hot in Barcelona it's not that much it's like 28 degrees but the humidity in this town it's out of control it's horrendous and also to get a good of a good light for the video I'm actually sitting next to the window where the sun is hitting like like a meter from me so I'm gonna die for this channel I'm probably gonna lose like two kilos recording this so I have for you today three pairs of shoes a pair of Vans a pair of Saint Laurent and a pair of Isabel Maran also I have a bit of clothing mainly from Zara so we'll start first though with the biggest purchase this past two months which is da -da 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 -da, my iPhone I'm probably the last person on earth to have that Blackberry like I think Blackberry probably like actually closed the doors after I you know retire my one it was really bad because the software was so obsolete I couldn't actually have Instagram on there I just had it on my iPad I'm obsessed with it especially because it makes my Instagram life easier and I'm really enjoying it so if you want to follow me there I leave the link down here it's at Maria Balanza Castello and I post pictures and small videos uh, almost like daily or every other day. The Outnet, which is the outlet from netaporte.com. So they're always on sale there. I got a pair of Isabel Maran boots. This was an, a spur of the moment purchase, but I actually wanted coming autumn, the YSL version of this type of boot, which they are like 595 euros. So when I saw these ones that they are called the Priestly Velvet Gentleman, and they were like 500 something, but they were reduced to just over 200, I think, 230. So I thought this is my opportunity. So I actually got them because as I have a size 36, normally they are the sizes that they do have in that type of website. And these are the boots in question. They are super comfortable because they are quite uh, wide here at the front and they're really stretching very nicely. They have the Cuban heel here at the back, so they give you your legs a bit of like a heel effect so they're not completely flat but still you can be all night dancing on them and you have no pain on your feet at all and then the detail that here it's a panel and stretch I think it looks nicer on my legs and on the inside they're actually gold so these shoes I actually got them like two months ago and I thought well I leave them on the box and I thought I'm gonna leave them for next autumn but then I got inspired by Kourtney Kardashian because I actually really like her style it's kind of like tomboyish but elegant and she really uh, loves pairing this type of boots with like denim cutoffs so that's what I've been mainly doing especially to go out at night you have like a nice pretty top denim cutoffs and this so you can be dancing all night it doesn't matter if uh, drinks are spilled on them because you know like they're black and even though they have a few kind of like stains and scratches I think this is a type of boot that even if it goes a bit aging it doesn't matter because it still looks good then from Barnes the old school in the black suede and I got them in a size 35 European so these are the trainers in question super famous and mines are exactly the same ones as my high tops. They have the leather detail and the uh, black suede. And the thing that I actually enjoy these ones more is that they don't actually have the band red label kit at the front. So from the front, they are completely ba black and they are very white. So they are actually looking super cool with like the denim cutoff. I do live on them during summer month and also with like wrap round skirts. I have a few pictures on Instagram wearing these and a few videos and I am obsessed. They are so, so comfortable. And then the last pair of shoes, they are the prettiest. Oh my God, this pair of shoes, I got them ages ago. These ones are actually from back in March and I ordered them from Luisa Via Roma. It arrived in like within 24 hours, so it was great. So it comes in this beautiful um, Luisa Via Roma box and then inside, you have this very nice, I love the actual uh, material on the box. This is my first uh, Saint Laurent pair of shoes. So they are the Lulu suede mule sandals and I got, whoa! Thanks God I used to work in a circus, yeah? So they are in the 70 millimeter heel. These shoes were, if I'm not wrong, 495 euros 
and I think they are sold out everywhere. I'm gonna try to link them down below though because you need to have this pair of shoes in your life because they are perfect. They are fantastic. These are the shoes in question. Let me just take one because it'd be easier to show it to you. So you see they have the YSL symbol here in gold on the heel and they are all black suede, black suede here, these two straps and then you have this Saloran here written in gold. These shoes have actually been sitting in the box for like good two months because it was still too cold to wear them and they are so comfortable. They look fabulous when you have a skirt or a dress. I think they're a very 90s type of shoe, so they're kind of like this sexy but masculine style because they are square here. Now you probably will say, how are these shoes masculine? But I know what I mean, like they're not pointy. Like, I don't know, they're perfect. This 70 millimeter heel, I can walk all, that, all day on them and I don't feel anything. I have actually went out on a date and I actually end up dancing all night in these shoes and I kept just telling my friend my god my son Laurent are being inside like a disco I'm gonna die they had drinks spill on them they're fine you have a bit of the mark of the toes here but this is normal when you buy suede shoes so these I know they're all, all over the high street now I know Zara has them without the YSL also like it it hasn't got that on there of course but these shoes are perfect, perfection. I seen them higher. I know Maria Draganova was in a blog saying that she wanted them, but I think this shoe in higher will be a bit like sexier, yes, a bit more uncomfortable too. So I, you know me, I like to settle for like lower heel, but I can actually walk around all day. So on to clothing now. I went in Zara looking for a skirt. I managed to get two. This is one of them and it's from the Denim Trafala collection, which is the younger looking line. And it was very good price, $19.95. It has these ripped details here, also the one here. This cutting here, I think it makes like my legs look sexier and I think it elongates them. Since I actually got this skirt, it's pathetic, but I actually think I wore it like three times on the first week. Then the other skirt, it's kind of along the same lines, but different. Like this, I think it's kind of like sexy, casual, but the other one is so elegant. Wait until you see it. This is the other skirt in question. Check it out. I am obsessed with it. I gotta say I was so lucky because it was one of the things that they first came out of Zara and then you buy it and then within two weeks it's sold out and they have produced similar things, but they have not produced this exact same one. Like now they have one with like big pearls, but not the tiny ones and without the uh, ripping. So, and like, I think this skirt, it's fabulous. Like every time I have worn this, you can see the people are actually staring at the skirt. And I had so many girls coming to me and asking where the skirt is from, asking on Instagram. This is from Trafalog also, so it's the younger line. But I got this one in a size small instead of an extra small. And you can see it fits me so, so nice. I'm not sure why I'm showing you my abs, but there you go, they go for free. So a size is small, as I said, and this was more expensive. This was like $25.95. But that goes to say that Zara clothing, it's like sizes, whatever, like this is a size small, that is a size extra small. And then I like pairing this skirt with the YSL heels, like the meals that you saw. And this, is, this shirt is also new. It's from uh, Zara Basic and it's a size extra small, $22.95. And I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to appreciate it, but it's that type of like the smart, elegant men shirt. You know what I mean? Like the one that you can actually see all the threads. So I am obsessed with it. And then normally what I do is I have it rolled up slips and I have it completely tucked in, but I didn't want to do it because if not, I'm actually going to wrinkle it completely. So I normally have it like this. And I think I look like very smart, but casual and very put together. So this is an outfit that I am obsessed with it. And I have actually been repeating it quite a bit. Next oh. item, I got it like three days ago for 12 euros only. I believe it probably was like 30 before the sale at Zara. And it's a very thick fabric. So I'm not sure how good is this going to be for summer month. I got it in a size extra small and it's that kind of fabric that it kind of like tags you in. A very nice staple item for your closet. It has this off the shoulder detail here, which I think it, sh it fits me perfectly. You don't need to wear a bra because it's actually 
quite tight here at the top and it closes with a zip here so it's overall it's very nice it's comfortable even though it's actually the smallest size is quite stretchy so you could perfectly eat on there so this is the dress that i bought yeah we got to the heavy metal part of the video so you know i listen to this type of music hardcore punk heavy metal that's my music of choice so i was very happy when h m came out with like band t-shirts but like in a softer more feminine type of fabric so i like the detail that they have the very big slits here at the side so i like wearing them with like a small bra like a small bralette that it has maybe like a bit of lace to have a bit of contrast this is quite big like i have them in size small both of them even though uh, the extra small fit me but i like more the fitting on the small they are only 15 euros each 14.99 and i got the iron maiden with the number of the beast, which is kind of like a dark washed off black and it has all the, like the rib details here on the hems, which I love it and then I also bought the Metallica Ride the Lighting one which this one, it's a bit more onto like the very dark uh, grey tone these trousers 22.95 from Zara Trafalak and they are kind of like my ruby rose pants I call them because I think she has the ones that they are a bit longer normally please excuse me if I'm actually not trying this on for you but if I actually put this pair of skinnies on me I'm gonna have to have them on until September so they will get stuck and they will not come off so that's why I'm not trying them on skinny in lead grey in a size 34 they are awesome they are super super soft they are very stretchy and they almost have kind of like this peach effect like it's so nice like uh, to the touch and they are like very dark um, gray or like washed off black also the hems are like this so I love pairing this with that and then the Isabel Maran boots and I think I look very cool I actually went out clubbing like this um, back like in May when it wasn't that hot so this is another purchase and these trousers were $29.95 and they are from the Zara Woman Premium Collection. So this next item, I think I went mad because two minutes ago I had an Aero Maiden t-shirt and now I think I look fabulous in a marshmallow pink pair of trousers. So my passion by polarity is reaching stratospheric levels. So let me know what you think. I pair this pair of trousers with like my Valentino Glam Lock, which I'm very much enjoying wearing it as a clutch lately. I think it looks super cool. This is the white shirt from before and on my feet I have the YSL Mules. The trousers in question are this Lean Boyfriend and they are medium rise. So I'll show you this so you can see all the details in case you are interested. They are on the sale now. I paid for them 30 euros, but now on the sale they are for 19.95, so 10 euros less. And I got them in a size 38. No, sorry, 36, one size too big because I wanted them to be baggy. All these holes here actually did have all these strings, but I actually cut them because I think it looks nicer when you can see my flesh. And I'm actually planning on cutting them a bit bigger here and maybe making a hole around here. Now, I'm conscious that this pair of trousers, it's not something I'm going to become a basic wardrobe staple for me. This is not going to be the pair of trousers I'm going to be reaching like every day. But I think for 30 euros, it's a bit of color. It's crazy because it's light pink. But I think even in winter months with like the Isabel Maran boots and maybe like a very big oversized black knit, I think it's going to look like the touch of acid color to like my neutral outfit. And with that, we got to the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it, guys. I hope you find some items that you like and you can get them from the links down below. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any of the upcoming videos and give this video a big thumbs up. And I would love to hear in the comments down below, did you like the pink trousers? Did I go mad? Which ones were your best purchases this past one and two months? And I hope you have a fantastic day, guys. Take care. Bye.